This is Chad with homeschoolwebmaster.com. Take a look at your structure. We're going to talk about an additional way to adjust your dashboard. Um, I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time on this today. Um, but if you go to structure and go to dashboard, this is a reflection of the dashboard we first talked about uh, on the left hand side right here, but it's in a different configuration you can adjust your dashboard now let's look at that again just to make sure we understand if you remember you've got this dashboard you can look at you can customize the dashboard right here where you're looking at it um, drag and drop one of these down into it right there push done and then you've got the additional default shortcuts right there so let's go back to our structure and our dashboard and you'll notice the shortcut shows up here so this is just a reflection of the dashboard and you can assign it kinda like you would a block where you want it do you want it in the dashboard sidebar which is over here or this now the nice thing probably with this it's a little easier to look at stuff here and you can configure the block right there um, so this is an overview of if, if you want a little bit of a different um, way to edit your dashboard this is the way to do it now once you go in and we've looked at this a little bit before you can configure that shortcut by changing the block title now what I don't like about this is when you change the block title here it's not just for the admin it's actually for all the block structure in the site and so be careful whenever you change the block title we're gonna go back here because it will affect your everybody the way the user sees it and everything since this is such a short uh, part I'm gonna go right into I'm gonna leave forms for tomorrow and we're gonna take a look at mail list today so we've looked at uh, dashboard and let's look at the mail list um, right here is the mail list this is the only list that you have set up by default it's join our mailing list um, you can import emails list emails let's see if there's anything in here no nothing in here but you can add emails you've got all these options right here uh, let's go back so let's add a list okay uh, what if you you know you have a default but what if you wanted to um, do a uh, a product information list okay so we're gonna save this and we've created the list you can add another one here it just pops up uh, let's go to settings and see what that did this is a subscription message hey thank you for uh, your interest your email has been subscribed so let's go back to list now so you've got join our mailing list product information list okay and then you can go in uh, and import emails into that list from maybe your first list if you have that going and you can set up as many names as you want now where do I access my mailing list well let's look back at the home page notice that right down here at the bottom you have join our mailing list that's not the best place for this but for this particular template that's where it's at so we'll leave it there but where did this block come from okay well if you remember go back to your structure and go to blocks and we're looking for uh, I'm gonna type in the word mail highlight all so we're looking through here because we'll probably see it there you go join our mailing list that was the default mailing list it's in the pre footer second okay but look at this product information list is now showed up in the blocks that wasn't there before it's because when you create a mailing list the way to access that mailing list is through a block so I could put this in one of the you know the different columns and we could have it show up on the right hand side of every page so that's where you access your mailing list is in the blocks and let's see if there's anything else that's it for that alright so that's two quick short lessons your dashboard uh, you can edit that a little bit differently there under structure and also you can set up additional mailing lists and trust me mailing lists are very very important alright guys I'll see you all tomorrow